saying true or false. I'm going to be giving you guys six facts about the Bible. I'm going to read them out of my special book here and then I'm going to decide if they are true or false. If they are true, I get to eat a donut. Yes, that's right. And if they're false, unfortunately, Sammy gets to eat the donut. And you guys can kind of participate and try and guess if it's true or false based on these six facts, these six Christmas facts about, well, from the Bible. So kids, fact number one uh, of the, from the Bible on Christmas. An angel told Mary in a dream that she would have a baby whose name would be called Jesus. Is this true or is it false? What do you think, kids? Well, unfortunately for me, that is false because an angel did appear to someone in the dream, but it wasn't Mary, it was Joseph. And the angel told Joseph in the dream that he would be the savior of his people and that he would save his people and the world from their sins if, if, they, if they came to trust in him as their savior. That's uh, fact number one and it's false. So Sammy gets to eat the donut. And these are the donuts, kids. Look at them. So patriotic as well. Look at these donuts. Now, they're a little bit big, so I don't know if you're going to eat through them all. But uh, yeah, I'm going to pass the camera on now to me. And Sammy is going to eat one of these donuts. You have to eat it all. camera. You better hurry up about it. Right, we've finished, finally. Now, hopefully next time I can eat one of these. Christmas fact number two. King Herod was very glad to hear about the Lord Jesus' birth. Well, that's a false fact. Actually, uh, King Herod was very troubled about it. And he actually wanted to know where the Lord Jesus was going to be born so he could kill him. So what happens now? Here we are then, another donut for this gluttonous girl here. Christmas fact number three, kids. When the angel came to Mary and told her the plans that God had for her, what did she say? Did she say, Behold, I am the servant of the Lord. Let it be according to your word. And I'll repeat that. Behold, I am the servant of the Lord. Let it be according to your word. True or false? Well, in this case, kids, it is true. So I get to eat the donut. Right, kids, here we go. Christmas fact number four, guys. Christmas fact number four. When the Lord Jesus was born, even the shepherds came to see him. That's a true fact. The angels came and told the shepherds that the Lord Jesus was born, and they sang, and they were very happy about it. So they went to see the Lord Jesus as well. So that's a true fact. And Ben gets another donut. So kids, we've only got two donuts left now, so I'm going to consume this one here and then we'll do the last two Christmas facts after this, okay? Thank you, kids. Right, kids, Christmas fact number five. I'm going to get it out of my little book here. Christmas fact number five. The Lord Jesus was born in a cozy home. So a cozy home like yours or mine, maybe it had a log fire, stuff like that. The Lord Jesus was born in a cozy home. True or false? What do you think, kids? Well, if you know the story, and we are going to be teaching it this month, but if you know the story, you'll know that that is false. Mm. The Lord Jesus was born in a simple little manger, in a stable, 
uh, many, many years ago. So that's where he was born. So it is false. Therefore, Sammy gets to eat the donut, kids. There we go. Right. Final donut, kids. Right, kids. Well, we've got one final uh, Christmas fact for you guys to guess at home. Now, as we've got no more donuts left, uh, in this one, number six, uh, if you guys guess it right and it's true and you guess it correctly, you get to eat something nice from your homes there at home, if your mum and dad let you. Christmas fact number six. The three wise men gave the Lord Jesus three gifts. Milk, a blanket and toys. Is that true or false? Well, that's false. Actually, they brought gold, frankincense, and myrrh. Now, I don't know if you kids realize this, but just as an extra little twist in the story, throughout these past few clips that you've seen of true or false, we've been hiding characters from this nativity scene here that you'll be able to see. So in this nativity scene, as you can see, we've got uh, the Lord Jesus in a manger, the cradle. We've got Mary and Joseph. We've also got the three wise men and we've got some sheep. So we've got the Lord Jesus in a manger. We've got Mary and Joseph. We've got the three wise men and we've got some little sheep. Now, as you can see in this complete nativity scene here, those are the ones that we want you to find. And we've hidden them in separate little videos across this video. So if you haven't seen them all, You'll have to go back to the beginning and find them again because we've hidden them in some of the scenes. Not all the scenes, but in some of the scenes. Well, kids, we hope you enjoyed this video. Sorry you didn't get to eat a donut there at home in the end. No, I'm kidding. You, you guys can have something to, uh, to treat yourselves if your mum and dad let you and if you've completed all the questions. Um, anyway, that's it from me and Sammy and from everyone from Bramwood Hall. Hope you enjoyed this video, guys. See you in the next one. See ya! Now, uh, so, fact one then. Uh, so let, right. Christmas fact number, fact. Christmas fact number three, kids. Uh, and he... On to Christmas fact number four, guys. Now, in this final, uh, uh, well, we've got... Right, kids, well, we've got one... Actually, they brought... So that's the end of this video now, and um, you probably... So that's another false fact, so you guys don't get to eat any food at home.